It was my senior year in high school and I was a few months away from graduation and had gotten into a, a pretty horrible car accident. And I remember the day that they wanted to discharge me from the hospital. And my mom, who's a practicing physician of 30 years, had such a breakdown in the hospital room. That feeling of helplessness she had, I kept seeing that during my time at the hospitals while scribing as a pre-med student, this overwhelming sense of helplessness. That was a big part of what led me to want to do this and to have that strong calling to provide that level of support to these patients and to this community who doesn't have a lot. My name is Vivian Bellert. I graduated from ASU College of Health Solutions and I'm the founder and CEO of Gellert Health. I had not decided where I was gonna go to college yet. And then I heard about this program through College of Health Solutions called Medical Studies. And that seemed interesting. I didn't have to commit to biology or chemistry. It was a little bit more holistic. And really what that program was able to give me was truly the first feeling of what healthcare is now today. Healthcare isn't just that 15 minute appointment with a PCP. It's behavioral health, it's diet, it's the social determinants of health. And at ASU College of Health Solutions, I started to see that this was way more than just pure medicine. The biggest thing that ASU gave me was the flexibility and the freedom to think outside the box. At 19 years old, I launched Backpack, a volunteer group of college pre-med and nursing students where we would hand out backpacks to individuals experiencing homelessness. Since graduating, I founded Elaine and Gellert Health. We Lane, uh, health navigation and transportation for the homeless. In just the first six months, we saw that these patients who typically have above a 50% no-show rate to appointments were now starting to have below a 10% no-show rate to appointments. And then, we were called to scale, and that is where we are now as Gellert Health. A big part of what Gellert Health does is making sure that we're looking at this patient holistically. We really integrate ourselves into their healthcare journey and really into their lives and making sure that they get to go to the grocery store if they need to, that they have social cohesion and a community to feel like they're a part of. We get to see where do they live? What type of environment is that? What are they eating? What's their access to even just a shower or to clean clothes or to clean socks? An important part of the work we do is meeting the patient where they are, whether that's a street corner, a wash, a hospital bedside, or for example, veteran housing facilities. Down here is my medication. Okay. So you need to take them both okay. on a day of She's my sight. She's my memory. Because I don't remember. All right, let's let the right one. I would be totally lost without it. Totally. I remember when we saw the cardiologist for the first time, she says, I always want to see you in this office, never in the ER. And guess what? That was three years ago, and we haven't been seen in the ER since. Because he takes his meds, he's doing what he's supposed to do. And getting to all these appointments, which is, which is a lot. She is a blessing. Oh, she really is, she really is. I don't know. Any other individual, more harder than she does. She works hard. Everybody needs a somebody. And we are that somebody for the population who really has no one. And over time, we're able to build a relationship with that individual to make sure that they get back on their feet to feel human again. Like there is purpose for life and there is a way to live a better life. From the moment I said this idea of 
creating a new service for serving the homeless to now actually being an established company and the support we continue to receive. I am so grateful for the support ASU has provided me and the company, especially College of Health Solutions.